I don't know why I'm forgetting the name. Like I didn't make a whole ass video about all of the holiday drinks at Dunkin'. I love that I'm finding so many cute items for me. Also, look how cute this sweater is. It's so cute. It says opera. <laughs> okay, what do I need these? Barbie shampoo. Look at that beautiful sunrise. Christmas is in a week and I am not ready. And it's freaking me out and I have a lot to do. I've bought a lot of stuff, like presents and whatnot, but I need to go through them and figure out if I need to buy any more or if I'm done. I feel like I'm not done. So I, today's plan is to figure that out and then to get additional presents and things if I need to. I also need to mail my Christmas cards because I have not done that. I'm also getting my nails done because as cute as this purple is and was, I've had it on for a month and it's just it's not looking great and also i want something more holiday christmasy new year's eve sparkly something or other i'm still not totally sure what i'm gonna do but i'll figure that out first thing to do today is to go get some coffee i am hungry and i'm also not caffeinated it's way too early on a saturday for that to be what's happening so we need to rectify that and i'm gonna get a what's it called brown sugar cookie cold brew i think it's called i don't know why i'm forgetting the name like i didn't make a whole ass video about all of the holiday drinks at duncan i'm excited to have the cookie butter cold brew i haven't had it in a minute but i remember that being one of my favorites from my whole big video that i did so it's gonna be delicious well this is our elf nick he's uh apparently swinging from the chandelier these are the freaking cutest it took me a while to find them because they were sold out all over the place but they're so cozy and I, I love them. I know that I could technically wear them out of the house, but I don't, I like wearing them in the house. So they're just my in-house little slipper boot thingies and they're so cute. Christmas tree. I'm excited because nobody else is awake right now. So I get to enjoy my coffee and my bagel in silence. Love it. I definitely just spent like 20 minutes cleaning so that I could actually like sit down and enjoy my breakfast and not be stressed about the mess that was existing around me. <laughs> And there's definitely still mess existing around me because the dishes are ridiculous, but I don't have the energy for that right now. I need to like put something in my stomach and get some caffeine. So I'm going to do that. I'm going to ignore the dishes. They're behind me so I can't see them. Therefore, they don't exist. <laughs> I'm to get these nails done. They look so bad. Like, I mean, it's not terrible, but they're so grown out. <laughs> I need something different right now. Let's go. My nails turned out so good. I really wanted to go for something that was sparkly and fun, festive for the holidays, but also I could wear for New Year's Eve. So I went with this like pearly white with gold glitter on top and it's so pretty. I love it. I also ran into some Girl Scouts on my way out and they were like, do you want to buy some Girl Scout cookies? And I was like, I totally do, I totally do. So I bought one box of each of my favorite kinds. They're so cute, I keep looking at them. I'm gonna go to Target to take a couple of things back and then I'm gonna go into either TJ Maxx or Home Goods or one of those stores and kind of see if I can get some additional stocking stuffer type of items for several people. And then I have two little kids that I have to shop for. I got one thing, but I need one more thing and not my kids, like my, my cousin's kids. I'm gonna see if I can find something at one of these stores for him. So I was gonna do this whole clip about how they do drive up returns at Target now and you don't have to leave your car and like that's what I was gonna do. And then it didn't work. So I had to end up going inside to return my items so in this case it was not convenient at all but that's okay i got my money back and that's what counts so now on to the next door i think i'm gonna go over to home goods off to home goods this is not what i was looking for but i love valentine's day sprinkles so i had to get these i know i don't need these but look at the little hearts at the bottom these are so cute i'm not gonna get them i really want to but we're not shopping for right i love that i'm finding so many cute items for me that I don't need to be buying. But these are cute. And they have it in pink. I'm like annoyed actually. Don't walk away, all right? But that's really cute. Again, not what I'm here for, but I feel like I need these. These are really cute. Okay, this might be one of the things that I'm looking for. So I'm gonna get this. I was really hoping I wouldn't find these because I saw somebody post about these. Oh, they're plastic. I don't like them as much now. Okay, that's good. Cheap though. I mean, they're cute. I just, I probably won't use them. Okay, but do I need these Barbie champagne boots? This is Aria. No, this is Nesta. Stop. All right, I got part of what I was looking for and only a few things for myself. So I'm going to consider that a successful trip. So I'm about to go through all of the gifts that I got for the kids to make sure we're done or if we need to buy more. And I realized I haven't 
decorated my office for Christmas. Yeah, all my little decorations are sitting here. I haven't even put my pink tree up. It's just sitting in the hallway. And my office is just like, I mean, it's cute, but it's just basic. There's no holiday spirit here. Also, look how cute this sweater is. It's so cute. It says, I'll pray. <laughs> all right, so I have my dough thawing here. I'm going to do a little Christmas baking. I don't really know what I'm doing, but let's see if it works out. Hopefully, if nothing else, it'll be a fun little evening activity for me. I also, I'm so excited about my new planner. I just got this on Black Friday and I got customized with my little name on it. I got it from Erin Condren and it looks so cool. And I'm trying to dedicate myself to actually keeping up with the planner because a lot of times I'll have a lot of steam in like January, February, and then I kind of lose it. So hopefully I will be able to actually stick with it in 2024, but we'll see. We're gonna try. <laughs> Let's start, I think, with the Nutella thing and the puff pastry. All right, so I got these little cookie cutters. So I think I'm gonna try to make little shapes instead of doing like a full Christmas tree type vibe. All right, now that we've got that all spread out, I'm going to roll this one just a little bit so it matches the length of the first piece. And then I'm gonna lay this on top like a little sandwich and then cut out some fun little Christmas shapes. I honestly don't remember if I like this taste of Nutella, so that'll be interesting. <laughs> All right, and now we're gonna brush the egg wash, which is just egg mixed with a little bit of milk on top of them, so you can get nice and shiny. All right, and now we're gonna put it in the oven. The original recipe said like 15 minutes, but since they're so small, I think I'm gonna do a little bit less and just keep an eye on them. Okay, these turn out so freaking cute. Some of them like exploded a little bit, but they're still really adorable. And I've already eaten a couple of them and they're very good. <laughs> they're so cute, little miniatures. Love it, turned out well. And now it's time to say goodnight. I'm gonna do a little bit more shopping for the kids for Christmas, and then I'm gonna go to bed. Thanks so much for watching this vlog. Make sure to like and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.